Welcome back guys. We're going to Mars. Oh yes we are. This is the equivalent of the SpaceX Starman mission. So really we should be flying a uh, Falcon Heavy but we don't have the SRB boosters yet so it's just going to be a Falcon 9. Um, which in reality wouldn't wouldn't have the oomph to get us to Mars but hey it like it is what it is. It is what it is. Uh, what are we going to do while we're waiting for that to build? Oh by the way this is a race against time. Because uh, NASA get there in six months. So, yeah, this is going to be very, very tight. We build ours in four. So we, if, if we could launch the next month, we'd beat them. Oh, it's going to be close. It's going to be very, very close. In the meantime, we've got this mission to launch. So let's do it. Okay, we've completed the mission control expansion research so that we can build that building. That'll be good. That means we can fly um, three missions, which would be awesome. Right. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. We're flying on a suboptimal day. This is not going to be good, reliability-wise. We could do it some very, very good conditions. Okay, well, it's looking, um, it's looking like a nice day. We've got a little bit of cloud, a little bit of high-altitude cloud. But I'm thinking we should get a, a little bit of a bonus, maybe. Maybe. And boy, do we need it, I think. Uh, let's have a look. Oh, look. Minus 21. Oh, excellent conditions. Oh, and that pulls us down to only a 19% chance of critical failure. One in five chance of critical failure. You've got to be kidding me. Go on. Well, do do all the rituals, guys. Touch wood. Cross your fingers. Cross your legs. Cross anything. Here we go. Oh, that is beautiful. Okay, it looks good off the pad. Is it? Is it starting to tip over? Oh, it's angling a bit. Oh, I think it's going to actually make it. Oh, come on. Oh, my God. <laughs> How lucky am I? I mean, seriously. It not only did it not blow up, I get a secure launch. Man, yeah, I'm not going to complain. I'm not going to complain. Oh, Colonel Failure, please tell me you're watching this. Right. So, when we get some decent reliability with these things as well. All right, let's go. Let's go. So, all we've got to do now is uh, get this puppy into a nice stable orbit. What do I need? We have got to get 9, 7, and 4. Uh, well, let me let me get on and see if I can do it. Well, this has been really easy. Uh, last turn, all I need is... Uh, let's see. That's, I can do a couple of recharge powers. One of those, and I'm there. So, so many, uh, with one to spare. Ho, ho, ho. Do it. And boom. Didn't even need the extra power. Accept. Oh, let's have a bit of rejoicing, guys. It's not a milestone mission. They, they, they won't stand up. They're like, yeah, yeah, well, whatever, whatever. Okay, and we get the bonus. So, nice. 260 for six months. That's, that's not bad. Uh, we get a bit of rip, rep with the um, the, the Ruiz or the uh, or the Chishans. I'm not sure which one it is. I, I actually do know. Of course, it's the Chishans, not the Ruiz. Uh, and we get a nice bit of support out of that as well. So that's not bad. Cool. Well, we did it. What are we going to research next? Well, um, I would like to get... Oh, didn't mean to do that. I would like to get these three buildings researched so that we can get the advanced demolition bonus. But I think at this point... Now, I've got two choices. I, I can either push on down to do like Mars orbit, Venus, Mercury, or I could do the multi-crew orbit. And I think I'm actually going to try the multi-crew orbit. And the reason for this is if I go out and have a look at the multi-crew orbit mission, um, there's only the um, there's only the uh, the Chishans, the, the Chishans have, have, have researched it. Nobody else has even researched the mission, so I think we stand a very good chance of actually getting that done. And it's um, it's pretty decent in terms of the rewards. I mean, okay, it's not quite as good as the uh, the, the Mars Mars Mercury Venus missions. But it should be a little easier and cheaper and faster. So that's what I'm thinking of doing. Right, base. We need to put in, where are you? The Mission Control Expansion Building. Which, um, this is Mission Control over here. So if we put it somewhere over here, we get plus 2% reward for missions. And that's nothing to be sniffed at. What's that? 550. That's 725. 625. Well... That's where it's going then. That only cost me an extra 50k. Right, that's where we're doing it. 
Okay, next. Be very decisive. Okay, we've got three months now. Uh, I do have an open mission slot, don't I? Yeah, I do. Um, so, so I've got an open mission slot. Now, I want to do the multi-crew orbit. Uh, how long till that building gets built? And so this is kind of critical. So you take how long? You take six months to build. Damn. I would really like to do something like this uh, Earth's Oceans. That's 2,000 science and there's a 25% bonus. That's like 2,500 straight away. Um, but that's going to take a while. I wonder if we do something like relatively quick, maybe. Although, I, I, you know, no, because you know what? No, we'll free up a slot uh, fairly soon anyway, won't we? Yeah. Because we'll free up the Mars fl flyby slot. Go on, yeah, let's do it then. Let's do it. Go on. Earth's Oceans. Earth Oceans it is. 2,000 science. That'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Uh, the Yeah, and it's just... It'll be a, a Star 37 and an Atlas, I would think. Right, plan mission. Do it. Select the payload. It's another goes... Uh, it's not, i got to say, this is not staggeringly reliable. But I'm, I'm just going to go for the standard one. Oh, I'll manage somehow. Right, got solar system. Right, now we are focused on the Mars flyby. What's the, what's the state of play? There's nobody else going for it. We're in the planning stages. Well, let's, let's. Where are we? We've got three months to completion. So, go on. Uh, we've only got like 400 science coming in, which is not terrific. Go on. Oh, astronaut accused of spying. Penelope Brandt, how very dare they. We'll dismiss the allegations. This is going to lose us 200 support, but we know that we'll get that back, so it's cool. How, how is that? We're still not into the next tier. We need a bit of support. All right, here it is. This is the big one. Oh, come on. Power cut. Earth topography science output reduced by one month. Well, that... That costs us, I don't know, a bunch of science, which is not good. All right, here we go. The Mars flyby. Uh, mission training bonuses are increased by 100%, which is very nice. And I tell you what, normally this is not good. But on a Mars mission, this is actually good. Optimal and suboptimal launch windows are reversed. Oh, please tell me that works for us. Come on, come on. Uh, well, let's see. So we want science. Come on, give me a launch date. Yes, yeah, <laughs> we can beat NASA to it. All right, and we've got a decent-ish launch reliability. Do it, do it. We can get there first, yay. All right, confirm setup. Go to solar system. Uh, we have... Um, we've got to build the vehicle for this Earth Ocean mission. What are we going to use? Yeah, it's going to be a Block 5C, apparently. Okay. Um, so, what? Is, yeah, that, yeah. Okay. That's, if that's the... Uh, I can't remember the, the... Oh, here we go. The Delta and the Star 37. The Delta looks weird with the... The Atlas would look so much better. Okay. Build it. How long is that going to take? Seven months? No way. Okay. Well, it, it is what it is. Kill that takes a long time to build. That's like a crazy amount of time to build. Oh, well, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, what are we going to do next? I, sh I should have looked at the contractors. I know. I know. I should have looked at the contractors. Uh, next, we're going to do the Mars flyby. Now NASA, so look, see what's going on. Um, so the 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 Chishans, the Chishans are launching um, multi-crew orbit in twelve months. Uh, NASA have completed phase one of the Venus impactor, which is that. Yeah, what else is going on? NASA's launching the Mars flyby. Yeah, we know that. Penelope's returned to active duty. Excellent. Soviet Union launching the the, the Venus impactor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. 
Yeah, nothing, nothing terrifically important. Okay, good. Right, let's go on with it. So, Mars flyby, please. Well, I mean, keep your fingers crossed is like all I can say. This is our opportunity to beat NASA and get a first launch. Have we got a nice day for it? Well, we've got a nice... E well, it might be a nice night. Oh, we've got a nice night for it. And this, I tell you what, this is a fairly pretty looking rocket on a very, very pretty looking night. This is the Block 5E, which I didn't save the design of. Oh, excellent conditions. We've only got a 10% chance of critical failure. I tell you what, we've only got like a 45... What is it? 40% uh, chance of a negative. So, let's do it. This is a big one. The Mars flyby. Oh, come on. Come on, baby. Okay, how does it look off the pad? Oh, it looks okay. Um, there's a lot of... Okay, approaching max cube. It's tilting a little bit, but I think that's actually... That's nominal. That is the nominal trajectory. We made it. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Oh, well, we get what plus one now on the first task in the mission. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how I do it, guys. Like, you can see, like, I'm not reloading or anything. <laughs> Seriously, if the colonel's watching this, he's just, he's just going to want to shoot me. All right, let's, let's do this. Let's do this. Oh, dear. Right, so the Mars flyby. Now, you get to see this one because this is a milestone mission. So, we need... What do we need? We need 11 and 10. But we already get a bonus one. <laughs> All right. So, obviously, we, we want to get the thrust. We don't have a decaying orbit, so we can just get them. We only need 10. So, I guess, let's kick off. What do we... Uh, the other stuff we want is the... It's the best way to get nav. Uh, now it's not that easy to get. Okay, let's kick off with that. And now see, I could, because I've got that bonus one, I could then do the solar flare analysis to get a bunch of nav. And then that opens up loads of possibilities. Then I can get, um, well, I want to use, I want to use my thrust, don't I? That's the thing. Well, mind you. I've got four turns. I don't need to do it. Three of those is 12. So I actually don't need to do it first turn. So yeah, maybe that would give me my two comms for next turn. And I've got the nav. I've still got some data. Um, Let's do that then. So, confirm. Boom. That worked nicely. And, oh, and I get a bonus. <laughs> can't help it it's not it's not i haven't got a mod or something that, that boosts my luckiness the sky storm lucky mod uh, i can afford to lose that oh no it'll cost an additional one yeah that's fine um yeah that's fine well, i can live with that okay so that means this turn uh, I can do, like, I can do one of those to get some more nav, can't I? Yeah. And then I can turn nav into... Well, I've got to do the thrust this turn, haven't I? Yeah, I have. So I could maybe do nav and that one. That starts to get me close, doesn't it? Yeah, that starts to get me close. Like, confirm. Oh, almost a bonus. <laughs> okay, that's good. And the third one. Oh, three successes. Very nice. All right, cool. Oh, hang on a second. Have we got a decaying... Oh, we've got, we have got a decaying orbit. Ah, I did see that. Oh, it's okay. So that's not so good. All right. Oh, I didn't I, I, why didn't I see that okay well I didn't see it and it is what it is get over it what are we going to do we're going to 
that makes life a little bit harder. Okay, so I'm gonna need some comms. Oh, what's the best way to do this? Maybe, um, do we do, do we do that again? That gets me up to seven nav. And then if we do that, that gets me up to eight nav. Uh, and then I could do with some more comms. So maybe then I do that. That gives me tons of comms. So what I'm looking to do is do two, uh, two of these control burns in the last turn, which would get me loads. Go on, yeah, do do that. Uh, and of course we get a fail. But you know what? I can actually afford. I've got the power to actually resist this now, uh, if I wanted to. Um, I'm going to. You know, I've got the power to do. It. Oh, <laughs> get a bonus. Okay, well that helped. I wish it had been a thrust rather than a nav, but I'll take it. And then we get a normal. All right, cool. Yeah, uh, it's, I think this is doable. I think this is doable. Right, last turn. So I need, so if I spell, oh man, what's, I need, I need some nav. Okay, I've got to do two of those. Oh no, I only need to do one of those. Oh no, I'm fine because there's no there's no penalty on the last on the last turn. So no, this is this dead easy. Um, what's the easiest way to get? Uh, what's the easiest way to get nav? nav? Uh, that I suppose. Oh, I'm got. Uh, what's come on? There's got to be another way to get nav. Well, I could spend the two power and get, and I get uh, that gets me there. If I have the extra power, then I could resist a failure, couldn't I? That gets me to 11 and 10. Uh, that'll do. That'll do, I think. Uh, go for it. Okay, so... Oh, okay, that's what we needed. We needed one successful, and then I can resist. In fact, I think I could have resisted both. Oh, yeah, and I needed it. I needed it. Resist. And there we go. We're there. <laughs> oh, peachy. The Mars transfer trajectory is completed. And look at that. 144 science for eight months. 240. Oh, we don't quite get into tier five, but we're darn close. All right. So we are on our way. We're on our way to Mars. And I'm loving it. Right. We're almost there with the, with the multi-crew orbit. Um, let's see. Is anybody else uh, trying to beat us to it? So look, okay. So the um, the 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 Chishans, the Chishans are going to get there in uh, ten months. Okay. Oh, uh, now hang on a second. Let's have a look. So I've got to get this Earth Oceans one done, and that's going to take me. Yeah, how long till the the okay the the mission control expansion is complete in two months? Okay, I think we I think we might be all right. We'll see. We'll see. There's nothing else I can do, is there? No, I don't think so. That's the base. So yeah, two yeah two months. All right, keep going, keep going, push on, push on. Camera training. A camera manufacturer has offered to work with your technicians to adapt its cameras for space photography and to train your astronauts in how to use them. They claim that photographs from crewed missions could prove hugely popular with the public. Oh, now that's probably worth doing. If that gets us like a support bonus, go on, we'll do that. Camera training accepted. Hooray. Multi-crew orbit research completed. So we could, if I had a mission slot, uh, start doing that. But I don't have a mission slot, so I've got to wait until next month. Research. What are we going to research? That's a very, very good question. Um, the Gemini payload. That's what we're going to research. Because I can't start the mission yet. So no, we're not going to get first. But to be honest, if we're in the top three, then I'd be perfectly happy. Let's see. Is anybody else anybody else sniffing around this mission? Let's have a look. No, nobody else has even got the, the full thing re researched. So, All right, cool. Mission control expansion. Next turn. Go. Mission control is built. Awesome. NASA have completed phase one of the Mars flyby. They've also done the Venus impactor. Uh, we can now get a third mission and the third mission will be 
the uh, the multi crew once we can do it. How long is that going to take to research? It's 3,000 research. God, a while is the answer. Man. Uh, we need to get this Earth's Oceans once we get the science. God, we're kind of desperate for science at the moment. Wow. Okay. I don't know how the, I don't know how the AI keeps it up. They keep putting out all these missions. How are they, how are they researching so damn fast? It's crazy. Oh, well, never mind. Let's move on. Um, there's nothing else I can do, is there? No. Now, I'm just wondering. I was just wondering to myself, could I could I stop, um, like pause for maybe like even like one month or whatever, and maybe get something built? I would like to get this backup power generator, but I'd have to delay for like two months to get that researched. And I'm just wondering if that's. A, I I think maybe get this done and then maybe worry about that. Yeah, go on. Let's get let's try and get this done. So next event. Uh, not next event. Next month. Next month. Go. All right. Oh, there goes our mission. NASA are going. You're going the wrong way, NASA. We should have been going over here. Your lemons. All right. Uh, still nothing we can do. We're only getting like two fifty a month science. Jeez. Go. This is where we start to fall behind, unless we keep the, the science missions going. Uh, two more two more months till we get this blooming thing built. Um, and I've got that open blooming slot that I can't fill until I've done completed this research. Go. That seems like a hell of a lot of research. We need this, uh, we need this mission done. Go on, go on. So we've got, uh, oh, here we go. We've got a budget review. Oh, we don't, we miss it by 24 points. Man, an extra 45k a month we lost out on. All right, the Earth Oceans vehicle is uh, complete. Optimal and suboptimal launch windows are reversed. That's not good. Launch prep. So training will obviously be science because we want the science from this. And then launch date. Okay, we can go in March. Again, we'll... Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. We'll get an extra 5% science, so I'm not going to complain too much about it. Confirm the setup. Go. Uh, an extra 1,000 science. Yeah, it would have been nice to do it next month. We could have, we could have, we could have completed Germany a month early. Um, is anybody else sniffing around the mission? Let's all look. Multi-crew. No. So, yeah, I mean, we're looking. We're still looking good for a second or third place. I can I can live with that. All right. Oh, where's our... Where's our... Oh, look at this. We're almost to Mars. One, next month we'll be doing the Mars flyby. So we're actually going to open up two slots next month. Oh my god. Alright, go. Next mission phase ready. The Mars flyby is ready for its next mission phase. Oh, I can't wait. But apparently first we're doing the Earth Ocean launch. Earth Earth Oceans launch. We've got a reasonable... Um, <laughs> a reasonable... Oh, I should have... I've jinxed myself. I said we've got a decent launch reliability. But of course, that's tipping down with rain. Oh, what's that going to do to us? So we did have 10%. Oops, it's a 13%. Man, do I, like, should I reschedule? I mean, I'm not, I'm not desperate for this launch. You know what, I'm going to reschedule. I'm going to reschedule. Am I going to reschedule? I'm very, very tempted to reschedule because there's no panic to launch this. And I need that. I desperately, desperately need that science coming in. See, instead of, instead of like minus, minus, uh, sorry, yeah, minus 3%, I could have got like, like plus two, a couple of percent or whatever. I got this down to only like, seven, like maybe 7 or 8%. I'm going to, uh, go on. I'm going to reschedule it. Ah, oh, this is going to come back and bite me, I know. But I'll, I will get a bit more science, won't I? Oh, man. Okay. Yeah, well, I shouldn't have rescheduled. Optimal and suboptimal are reversed. Yeah, I should not have done that. Oh, man. Well, I'm just going to I'm just gonna go for the next month then. And we'll, we'll see. Okay, that... 
Bad plan. I should have just... I, why didn't I just... I, every time before, I've just launched it. Why didn't I just launch the darn thing? And I need the science anyway. I should have just damn launched the damn thing. All right, well, let's do the next phase of the Mars flyby, shall we? Yes, we shall. Right, come on. Oh, we're only one month ahead. We're only one month ahead. Come on. Oh, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Approaching Mars. Right, so. Uh, can we do this? What is this? The, the Martian injection or something? I don't know. So, what do we need? We need six, nine, and three for the bonus. Six, nine, and three. Right. So what's our best bang for buck? So either nav, nav or data, and then okay, we've got one to three ratio there. Okay, so let's pick up, let's pick up some data. Uh, we've got a one to three, one to th oh, this is all good stuff actually. Okay, so why don't we? So we've picked up two data. Let's turn. Let's do one of those and one of the, uh, yeah, one of, actually, one of those. Yeah, let's start with that. Go. All right. Oh, nice start. Nice confident start. We'll accept that. Oh, another nice one. Come on. Bonus. Ugh. <laughs> you know what? I will settle for three. Three successful. That'll do. Right. So, what is our what is our best way to get nav? It's probably with like power and cons, or maybe no, probably probably using nav, isn't it? Okay. So let's see. We can do. Uh, what can we do with com? You can't do a lot with comms, can you? Not a huge amount. Yeah, comms, comms is not particularly useful. We need to get a lot of nav coming in. What's the, seriously, what is the best way to pick up nav? Um, so I'm thinking if we do, do one of those and one of those. Actually, no, I don't want to do one of those because I, I can't really use. Oh, hang on a second. That one is bearable to get for nav. OK, hang on a second. So so if I did do to, to get four, yeah, to get four nav. OK, that gets me up to five. That gives me two extra nav. Uh, so, yeah, two, which I can swap for three data. Let's do let's do that then. Man, this, one, this one's a little bit tricky. Oh, at least to me. Oh, I've got a failure. Do I resist? Um, no, because comms is easy to come by. So, accept that. And we get a successful. Okay, so that's my, that's my comms. Sorry, it's my nav. Right, so I've got, I've got plenty of nav. Comms is easy to get. All I need, really, is data. So... I've got three power. What is the best way? So I can I can straight away just swap two for three. Um, then I'm not sure I even I even want to do that actually. <laughs> Man, okay. Well, I want to use nav. Or do I? I I guess I'm struggling a little bit with this. Um, man. Neither of those is a particularly great way to get the blooming nav that I need. And I need to pick up one comms or spend two and then pick up one. Oh, sorry, so pick up two and then spend one. So... Now, I still think I want to do that. And then how do I get, how do I pick up an extra comms? Oh, hang on a second. If I then do that and then do that again. Oh, there you go. That gets me to six, three. And then I just need two. 
Yeah, that'll do. Right, go. Okay, that's successful. And boom, successful. Okay. I've got it. You know what? I can actually resist that if I want. Um, I'm going to resist it because that's what I want. Okay, so all I need is two data. That's it. Six, nine, and three. Boom. Well, I'll add in a couple of extra power. And that will do. Pig. Didn't even need the extra power. Boom. Oh, come on. Mission Control, get on your feet. There they go. And there was much rejoicing. We've done it. Mars flyby. We're first. Woohoohoo! And now, because we finished uh, second or above in three missions, we get 25% off our research on vehicles. So. Uh, we get uh, almost 600 science for four months, which is awesome. Look at this, 900 support, which is going to push us well into the next tier, which is beautiful. We completed the Mars flyby in first place. Yay! Awesome source. Now, that means, yes, we will complete Gemini next mission. Uh, sorry, next month. Which then means we can switch our research to vehicles and focus on getting uh we can get the agena we'll probably get some uh, we'll probably get the boosters and uh, i'm thinking probably the titan 2 booster maybe is what i'm thinking yeah if you've got any tips on what you think i should research let me know so we now have two open mission slots if you can believe that so we should, uh, as soon as that's done, we should pick up the, uh, which one, what's it called? The, the multi-crew orbit. Okay, we won't get first, but second is still up for grabs. And then, and then what are we going to pick up mission-wise? I, I guess we'll have a look around and see what's good. We're doing Earth's Oceans. Astronaut recovery would be good for support. Uh, whoo if we wanted to bring some cash in, although cash is actually looking good at the moment. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe we do an astronaut recovery test. What do you think? Crew Dragon abort, probably that would be, wouldn't it? Or do you think I should be looking at the um, the Venus Mercury missions? I don't know. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. I will catch you for the next one. It's exciting stuff, isn't it? Seriously, I get to the end of every episode. My my, I've got sweaty palms. I, I feel drained. I, I, I love it. I'm having so much fun. I'll catch you for the next one, guys. Peace out.